Welcome to Storytime with Pastor Steve. Today's story is Elijah Helps the Widow. It's based on 1 Kings chapter 17. It's written by Nanette Thorson Snipes and illustrated by Susan Morris. Elijah came from Gilead, a prophet righteous and bold. He bravely spoke about a drought that God above foretold. No rain will fall upon the land, Elijah told the king. The prophet then went on ahead and found a place good for hiding. Hide in Kareth Ravine, God said. The ravens will feed you there. Elijah did what God had said, and he had food and water to spare. But one day Elijah's brook dried up. The water was gone, gone, gone. So God sent him to a widow who lived in a faraway town. Elijah watched as she gathered sticks and said, Please, do you mind? Bring me something cold to drink. A cake of bread would be kind. She turned to go to grant his wish, then said in apology, I have no bread, only some flour and oil for my son and me. With sorrow then she hung her head, with tears began to cry. I fear this is our very last meal. We'll eat it, and then we'll die. Don't be afraid, Elijah said. Go with your son and abide. But first make one small cake for me. The Lord our God will provide. Your jar of flour will not be gone. The jug of oil will remain. Neither one will ever run out until God above sends rain. The widow went on her way and did as Elijah said. With the pain she heated the oil and cooked a piece of bread. The widow came to give Elijah his cake of bread, and when he finished the last of it, she is there some for us, she said. In faith, she used it all that she had to give to the man that day. And as she turned to go back home, she heard the prophet say, Just as the Lord sent the ravens to feed me night and day, the Lord will send you oil and flour, so cast your worries away. In fact, God said there would be food each day for mother and boy. And for Elijah the prophet, God's word was a thing of joy. And the flour was not used up. The oil did not go dry. Elijah had spoken God's word in faith. The Lord for you will provide. This message is for all believers made clear to each of us. God will provide for all our needs. In him we can always trust. Just as Elijah and then the widow trusted God's words that he will be with us always and will take care of us, we too have the opportunity to listen to God's words and to hear him say that he loves us and that he will provide for us even in our times of difficulty May God open our eyes so that we can see the miracles that he does in our lives every day. May God bless you today.